You are warmly welcome on SLTV Lab. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you a warm welcome once again on SRA TV Lab. Today, I would like to show you the pelvis of a female. Do you get it? So, there is a pelvis, of course, for male. Now, this is the pelvis for female. I'm saying for female because, as you can see internally, we are seeing the reproductive organs of a female. That is why I'm saying we are going to see the pelvis of a female. So, we are going to see all the bones that makes the pelvic gedro. Then, next time, we'll see now the reproductive organs. Let's start with the anterior view. This is the anterior view. We are viewing this anteriorly. As a Good. Let's start with this part. Here we have a joint that connect both side pelvic gedro. Do you get it? This is called pubic symphysis. Do you get it? It is called pubic symphysis. This one. So it's connect both sides bones. Good. So I'm saying it's pubic symphysis. So when we come lateral to it, now we are going to see this pelvis. Good. We're going to start from here. This is called pubic tubercle. This is called pubic tubercle. Do you get it? And it's part of pubis or pubic bone. We are going to see the bones at the end separately. Each side is made up of three bones that are combined together to make a pelvic gedro. So now when we keep moving here, we see the pectineal rind. Do you get it? This is called the pectineal rind. Is that clear? Now, we move here, we see what we call anterior inferior iliac spine, then anterior superior iliac spine. Anterior inferior iliac spine, anterior superior iliac spine. Then here we see the iliac crest, the iliac crest. Just here at the iliac crest we see the tubercle of iliac crest. All of this is the iliac crest. Do you get it? Or when we come here, this is the iliac crest. And then this is the tubercle of iliac crest. Do you get it? Okay. Now, when we see this part, this wider part, is called wing or ala of irium. This bone, all of this bone is called irium. So, this is the wing or ala of irium. Get it? So, it's the same on both sides. Here, we see the... What do we see here? Pubic tubercle. Then when we move here, we see the pectineal rind. You get it? But pectineal line is right here. But here we see what we call the ramus. Lamus superior pubic lamus. So which means there will be the inferior pubic lamus. But here anterior we can see the superior pubic lamus. You get it so remember we move here we see the anterior inferior iliac spine then anterior superior iliac spine all s i mean a s i s you get it here is a i i s anterior superior iliac spine anterior inferior iliac spine you get it good when we project 
more posteriorly here there is an opening here this is called greater sciatic notch on both sides you can see this on both sides greater greater sciatic notch which means there will be also resa sciatic notch downwards good so this is the anterior view you have seen okay right maybe back on pubis before we go to another point we have said this is the superior lamus i mean the superior pubic lamus here is the inferior pubic lamus superior and inferior these two are pubic lemma i'm saying lemma because they are two but this superior ilia i mean superior pubic lamus then inferior pubic lamus let's continue remember this one don't ever forget this one this is the pubic symphysis do you get it so it connects both pubic bones this pubis these are the pubic tubercle good let's go now posterior to see what we find posteriorly now what do we find posterior here are you seeing clearly okay Remy. okay now this is fine when we see posterior of course we see the sacrum this is the sacrum do you get it this is there is a joint here it's called sacro iliac joint all articulation will be between ilium and the sacrum you get it here down here we see the tailbone or coccyx you get it coccyx this is the coccyx okay good remember here i've told you this is the inferior lamus the inferior lamus it's more anterior here we see another bone called ischium ischium do you get it it is called the ischial. Before, let me show you this big bone here that has a wing. It's irium. Posterior irium comes and reach here. Posterior here, we see what we call ischium. Then anteriorly, we see the pubis. So there is irium. There is ischium. There is pubis or pubic bone do you get it so there is here another opening here it is called obturator it is called obturator foramen do you get it will you remember this it is called obturator foramen i don't mean this muscle i mean this opening obturator foramen In a few moments, I've told you, here we have the greater sciatic notch, and down here we see the lesser sciatic notch. These are the opening for the sciatic nerve. Do you get it? This is very, very, very important. Very important. So, lateral here, we see the acetabulum. This is the articular surface of the hip joint you get it articular surface of the hip joint all right so there are so many things to show you but let's stop by here but before let me just show you what we call posterior what we call posterior iliac spine there is posterior superior iliac spine there is posterior inferior iliac spine like anterior Anteriorly, there are two spines. Anterior superior, it is anterior superior, iliac spine, and the anterior inferior. Now we see the posterior superior and the posterior inferior iliac spine. Do you get it? Good. Even the ischium itself has a spine. Do you get it? Ischio spine. Do you get it? Ischio spine. Ischium. You know, this is the posterior inferior bone. This is called 
ischium so it has what the spine ischial spine as well good let's stop by here see you next time when i show you the other reproductive organ and how they are positioned but let me just show you a bit how these reproductive organs also there is urinal system part of the urinal system but here it is the reproductive organs of a female so next time we'll talk about how they are positioned within the pelvis so guys thank you for watching the video i hope it's very helpful so please don't keep this information just with yourself share this information to your colleagues and see you in another video next time may god bless you abundantly please support this channel by placing like subscribe and the bell this is a huge support for this channel may god bless you